First go to the folder you downloaded. There you will see a PSD file called flyer. Open the flyer inside Photoshop. This one is a design ready flyer. You can straight away start designing it. Next we are going to create a solid background. For that select background folder. Click solid color. Here I am going to select color DF DF E6. Click OK. Next we are going to bring in a stock image. For that go to the folder you downloaded. Open image 1 inside Photoshop. Drag and drop the image inside our canvas. If you want you can resize the image. I am not going to resize the image here. I will settle with this one. Now I am going to change the blending mode to color burn. So that we will get a, some dusty effect like so. Next we are going to create a duplicate copy by using keyboard shortcut Ctrl J. Sorry Ctrl J. And I will reduce the opacity down to 40%. Fine now our background is ready. Next we are going to bring in our main model image. For that go to the folder you downloaded. Open image to inside Photoshop. Drag and drop the image inside your canvas. Of course you can use your image. This image is quite big. I'm going to resize the image by enabling free transform tool. Sorry, I'll place the image inside image folder. Now enable free transform tool control T. By holding shift key, I'll resize the image. Fine, I'll settle with this one. Next, we are going to bring in our waterfall mountain image. Go to the folder. Open image 3 inside Photoshop. Drag and drop the image inside our canvas. Make sure the mountain image is placed right above the model image layer. Now I'm going to clip mask this one. Right click. Create clip masking. Next we are going to resize the image by enabling free transform tool control T. Zoom out. By holding shift key I'll resize the image. Fine, I'll settle with this one. Next, we are going to add a layer mask to this mountain image layer. Now go to color picker, make sure the color is black. Now select soft round brush, this one, and erase the part you don't want. Fine, I'll settle with this one. Next, we're going to add a glow effect to our model image for that create a layer. Make sure the blending option is screen. Go to color picker, select color F4-7721, click OK. Now enable brush tool, select soft round brush. Give a single click on the left side. We will get a cool glow effect like so. Now we are done with our model image. Next we are going to bring in a, another stock image inside our canvas. For that go to the folder. Open image for inside Photoshop. Drag and drop the image inside our canvas. I'll place it at the top center. Fine. Next, we are going to add our text information. For that, select the text folder, create a layer, go to color picker, select white color. The font I am using is a free font. I will give a link in the description. You can download it. Now, type in your event details. I will create a duplicate copy, Control J. I'll reduce the size. Now I'm going to repeat the very same step, adding few more text content. Control J. I'll change the color as black. 
value the size I'll place it at the center next I'm going to add even date and ticket price fine now I'll select by holding shift key those two text layer create a duplicate copy Control J I'm going to use the same text layer to add ticket price now our flyer is almost ready as a final step we are going to add social media icons and another stock image for that go to the folder you downloaded open icons PSD file inside Photoshop there you will see icon folder drag and drop the folder inside our canvas I'll place the icons at the left side top this one is optional you can do it if you want now I'm going to change the color of the icons by double clicking the thumbnail I'll select black color I'll repeat the same for the other icons If you want you can add your social media URLs next as a final step we are going to bring in another stock image open image file inside Photoshop drag and drop the image inside our canvas I'll place the image inside image folder I'll create a duplicate copy enable free transfer tool give us a little rotation place it here Again, repeat the same step. Create a duplicate copy. Enable free transform tool. Give a slight rotation. So, our double exposure styled flyer is ready.